In this video, we're going to show you how to measure uh, an irregular shaped solid by volume displacement. So we have a graduated cylinder. We talked about how to measure in a graduated cylinder. I'm going to fill the graduated cylinder about half filled with water. And this is a 10 milliliter graduated cylinder. And it doesn't have to be exact because I'm going to measure the actual volume. Okay. So I'm going to measure this at eye level. So I've got to read the bottom of the meniscus. I'm going to try to get that in there so you can actually see it. All right. And so we're reading this at eye level. So this is um, 5 mils, 5.2, 5.4. And it looks like it's right at that 5.6 line. So I'm going to record 5.6 milliliters of water. And I have my solid that I measured out on my analytical balance. And we're going to carefully pour that into the graduated cylinder. All right. And I'm going to just tap it gently so that I make sure all the trapped air bubbles come out. And now I'm going to measure the new volume. And I want to make sure it's in here so that we can read it. And we see that it is reading 6. This is 6.2.4. It looks like it's lower than, uh, it looks like it's right actually on the 0.6 line. So it's 6.6 .6 milliliters. And that would be my new volume. And to get the volume of the irregular solid, you take the volume of the water with the metal minus the volume of the original uh, liquid alone, and you get the volume of your solid. Thank you.